<laughs> Here's your annual exclusion, $16,000 to you. Here's your annual exclusion, 16000 boo. Hey, y'all, check this out friend of mine, one of my African-American friends, yes, it is a black man that I highly respect. So we're talking, as we talk like every other day, if not almost every day, <laughs> so it's the end of the year. And he's like, hey, what's the amount to uh, give to family members? And I'm like, you know, I don't know. I'm not a mom. So, What's the amount to give? We're talking about the annual exclusion per Joni. Yeah. So I want to kind of share this with you. And this here, I've known a person that, that does this. So we're talking about the annual exclusion per Joni. Okay. So this year, uh, 2022, you can give $16,000 to a family member or your children which people that have money often do, and guess what? As some of you may already know, but maybe somebody doesn't know, guess what? The recipients, the children, the family members, they do not have to pay a gift tax, okay? They don't have to pay a gift tax. That's awesome. So it says, how much can a parent gift a child tax-free? In 2022, the magic number is, ladies and gentlemen, $16,000 per recipient. Okay, it is the gift tax exclusion for 2022, $16,000. Any gift above the exclusion is subject to taxes, but there are exceptions to that rule. We'll talk about that a little later. Well, I won't, but they can. Okay, and this is just for, I'm just sharing some information, having a conversation with you. I am not acting as your broker or as a tax uh, as a, uh, a tax person, your accountant, this is for entertainment purposes only, okay? But I want to share this with you. Child tax-free. You can give the child tax-free the amount of $16,000 in and the recipients do not have to pay. There's no gift tax on it. Okay, so here and check it out with Google. Uh, if you want to get more uh, expertise, professional opinion, please go ahead and talk with your CPA. Okay, so it says you can give up to the annual exclusion amount $16,000 in 2022 to any number of people every year without facing any gift taxes or filing a gift tax return. Now, if you give more than $16,000, in 2022 to someone in one year you do not automatically have to pay a gift tax on the overage so basically you're giving them uh, one person i know gave the girl ten thousand dollars okay guess what she has the money gift tax exclusion she's a recipient his daughter she doesn't have to pay gift taxes on it okay so I just wanted to go ahead and share that with you all, $16,000. And if you look at it, a lot of people, you can do this yearly, okay? And you can uh, put it, give it to the child, family member, and hey, maybe have them to invest it. Tax laws. And I think it's great, you know, it's good for them. But then I think about anybody, if you make what over six hundred dollars over you got to do a 1099 and you got to pay taxes on that so in another conversation which will be possibly another video it tells you it lets you know how who's in control and the laws that are written mm -hmm. interpretation so this is a way that they can give this to their kids every year. People can give their kids money every year. They can't afford it. Tax-free. Tax-free. But a working person, you know, if you're making a certain amount of money, you get taxed on everything. Hmm. Interesting. Now you see why they say many working people or poor people, we pay more taxes. And especially W-2 because the write-offs aren't there. So just wanted to share this with you. We're having a conversation. He asked me about it. I'm like, uh, 
really can't tell you. And I just Google this. And of course, you know, as usual, get the tax attorney on the phone or send them, sometimes send them an email. Do that. But yes. So the gift tax exclusion for year 2022 is a maximum amount of $16,000. Gee, uh, Mr. Kyrie Irving. Yay. Y'all could sure do that for a lot of people in the B.C. Business owners or your family members. I'm just saying. How many professional athletes have family members? Uh, how many of them would do this? Let alone your own children. Find the smartest in the family and do it every year. Have them save some of the money. Heck, put them in a brokerage account. But a lot of rich people, they do this. Now, again, I'm not giving you any tax legal advice now. Listen, it's not for the one that's writing the check. From my experience, and took with your own tax attorney, your own accountant, from my experience, don't think that, oh my goodness, I'm going to give this to this child and it's going to be tax deductible. Doesn't quite work like that to my knowledge. Okay? So you can't give the gift and go, oh yeah, you know what? I just gave little Kiki $5,000 and it's tax deductible. Yeah, I don't think it works like that. Okay? But it just lets you know for those that don't know, information is out there. So I don't understand if there's any rich person, especially from the BC, you know who to choose. You can do things like this. Okay? And that's a way to, you know, it's not going to be $16,000 in some cases. But I'm just saying, this is a way people can find talent within the group, within their family. So, yeah. It says, once again, you can give up to the annual exclusion amount of 16000 in 2022 to any number of people every year without facing gift taxes or filing a gift tax return. So, again, the person, the recipient, they don't pay gift taxes on it. Okay, so just want to share that with you guys. Let me know what you all think. Maybe some of you have engaged in this, you know? Some of you have. I've already checked into it because I'm not a mom. I'm an aunt. But I got some trades going on right now. Okay? And we're kind of up in the air. Yeah, it's not looking too good for you, girl. But it's okay. But we'll see how things turn out. And then, you know, this is what uh, I will more than likely, I'm going to probably try and do for, for, my, um, for my niece and nephews. Okay? So, wanted to share that with you. So, thanks for watching here. Simply Said on YouTube. Love you guys. And I'm out.